Hi guys, welcome back to another Daily Tarot Card. These are your Daily Tarot Cards for Wednesday, May the 10th, 2023. Today we are pulling from the Tarot of Dreams guidebook. So we have the Knight of Cups. I got the feeling of a male interested, or like I, I get masculine energy, someone interested in someone else. So I feel like interested in you at work. You know, we get the eight of coins and we have the page of coins here. You know what I mean? And I feel like, you know, you have to use your higher self here. This isn't something that's not going to work out. This is definitely something to keep to yourself. This is not something you go gossiping about. This is, you know, we were told like a couple weeks ago that, you know, there's something that's going to come in that you're going to have to keep your own counsel. And they're showing the high priestess with this as well. You know, and I feel like this is like, you know, using your higher self, going past the ego and, you know, feeling larger here this could be also like yourself where it is like you're in your shadow side with your water and it's like you're being stubborn you know what i mean i feel like this is like where the eight of coins it's like you know you can either thrive or you can sit there and fight in this situation it's like it's not such a big deal to fight like it's not worth the energy you know what i mean as you get older you will realize that people places and things are not worth your energy you sit there and you put yourself out there. You sit there and it's just like, you know, uh, you put yourself in situations and you're just like, oh, this feels awful. This feels gross. This, does, you know what I mean? Like, I don't like this. You know what I mean? It's not for you. You know what I mean? And I feel like it's like, I feel like this is more of your physical self that wants to be, you know, touched and kissed and hugged and everything else. But the thing is, it's just like, you know, some things are worth waiting for. You know what I mean? Um... And it may not ever come by, but at least you could sit there and say, I didn't give into my shadow side where I gave into this. And it's just like either, you know, they sit there and they're like, okay, never mind. Obviously they weren't interested in me and they, you know, or they're just like, well, you went, you went for that person. You know what I mean? So you really didn't care for me. You know what I mean? But I feel like it's like, because it's a work situation, it's just like, it's not going to work out anyway. So... They're saying it's not worth talking about. It's not worth gossiping about. You know what I mean? I feel like it's not even worth your job. You know what I mean? But I feel like this this rebellion, you know, when like in our situation, it's just like you know we got this training module. It's like you know we are we don't are we we have a absenteeism when it comes to higher ups right now, and it's just like some people are just oh, not some. They're just like oh well you know well you know I'm not gonna do it because. You know, I wasn't this and this and this. And it's like, that's fine. That's your stance. You could walk out the door and get a job tomorrow. You could get 12 jobs. You walk out the door, you probably have 26 jobs that you could apply for. Me, on the other hand, I'm not going back to babysitting. I'm not going back to making $30 a day, you know, working eight and a half hours. You know what I mean? And making nothing. And now in this day and age, who the heck can survive off of that? Like, you know what I mean? The way that groceries are priced and everything, it's like, oh, heck no. You know what I mean? So it's just like, you know, keep pushing forward. Use your higher self with this. I feel like that's what the magician shining this light in this situation is like, hey, come on. You know what I mean? Like, this is what's asked of you. This is the date. Are you going to sit there and wait for the date to come by and then stress yourself out more? Or it's like, you know it. Hop on. Do it. Done. You Now you don't have to think about it. You know what I mean? It's just like, you know show that you are an asset you're like let me help you help me so i can be more successful you know what i mean like we got a new system i absolutely hate it you know what i mean but the thing is it's just like how can i make it easier on myself well asking for help asking for chips and tips the more we do it the better experience we're going to be at it and then you'll just like the other systems we'll be flying through it like nothing you know what i mean it just it takes time we go to the high priestess, our higher levels of thinking, you know, on the, you know, the, on this flip side, it's just like, things are going to balance out June 3rd. You know what I mean? I feel like my son's birthday, they're talking about, you know, three cup celebrations, birthday parties, you know what I mean? And I feel like this is just like, well, you know what I mean? It, it's like, if you want to do, enjoy the finer things in life, you want people, you want to celebrate the way you want to celebrate without being on a, you know, budget. Sometimes, you know, our jobs transform and turn into all these things. I feel like there's just too much, too much change going on at once. But the thing is, it's just like in this situation, we all knew it was coming. You know, this is what they said. This module is coming out. This is how we're doing the training. This is how it's going to go. 
So like I said, like I sat there, I saw it, you know, I finished it. I said, I told my team, hey, just a heads up, there's this out. Some people are like, no problem, went and did it. Some people are like, oh, well, this and this and this and this. I'm like, well, then you could be this and this and this and this. And you know what I mean? It's like, why are you being difficult in a situation that you're putting too much energy and too much thought into something that doesn't even require that. You're putting too much brain power behind that. You know what I mean? So, you know, this is where you have to think for yourself. You know, it's like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, you're on a team and everything like that. But it's like, if you're all difficult like that, they'll be just like, all right, all of you, bye. You know, you're not doing what's asked of you. It's an opportunity to get rid of us. You, we were at, you were told that this was coming. You had a deadline. Why didn't you do it? This, oh, that's not an excuse. This is what it was asked of you. So, you know, people are going to be who they are. Don't let it affect you. Use your higher self. With the hermit, I feel like grounding yourself in this energy right now. I feel like the energy is, I feel like the energy is high. I feel excited and stuff, but it's just like, um, not knowing what's going to happen, what's around the other corner, but that's what life's about. And it's like, when we're wondering what's going to happen, it's like, still enjoy life, sit there and, you know, appreciate where you are in life. Appreciate the moments, appreciate the opportunities. You know what I mean? It's a little bit rainy here today. I was going to want to take some plants out and start putting them out. But so like I'm also being mindful of the frost of what plants I'm putting out just yet. Because we live in New Brunswick and we live in the north. They're asking, they're calling for snow. <laughs> it's like perpetual winter. Rebirth in our life. You know, this kind of crap was cute when we're, we're younger. When it didn't, in my case, where it didn't evolve, like affect anyone. It affects my kids, you know. I, I can't be between jobs and, you know, like I said, like, you know, I love babysitting on one hand, like watching the movies and having the kids around and arts and crafts and stuff like that. But financially, it's not cute anymore. You know what I mean? It's just like $30 a day. You know what I mean? Is nothing, you know, and half the time it's like, oh, I can't pay you this week. I'll pay you next week. You know what I mean? So it's just like, mm, you know, got to think that one really hard and th thoroughly. So the Knight of Cups were starting off. The stage of one's focus in an emotional matter. Yeah, exactly. What I was saying. So the Knights are doing. The Knight of Cups rec uh, recommends that you take emotional matters into your own hands. All too often we find ourselves paralyzed in relationships. Indecisive and incapable of, resp of responding. The Knight tells you to dive into the deep end of the pool. The Nine of Cups appreciates the beauty of his loved uh, Libra, which he uh, uh, worships with the ex ex um, intensive Scorpio. Funny enough, <laughs> Libra chain is Scorpio. Very intense. But I feel like at the same time, it's like, like they're saying, get in charge of your uh, emotions here. You know what I mean? It's just like, logically think. Like, you know, I don't understand people that put their children's you know, well-being, not so much well-being, like, you know, I think that's a little reach, but it's like, I know that financially, if I don't do what I'm supposed to, it will affect my kids. You know what I mean? So it's like, even though, yeah, like there's a lot of change going on. I like, I keep telling myself it's still fresh. It's still new. It takes time to get used to this. Like a lot of them, like, yeah, five, six months, like it's a lot better. I keep telling myself like that, you know, we got a, a system that's familiar to it, but it's just like, it's going to take time, you know, even, um, our boss that unfortunately is on leave, you know, even said the same thing. He's like, give it six months. You guys will be fine. And I'm like, yeah, okay. You know, and it's, that's where I'm just like, you know, how can I help myself to be better? What can I do to make myself better on this? You know, practice makes perfect. Slow, steady work, the labor intensive project. The, a sincere committed effort and that's the thing you have to be sincere about this so labor intensive project this is not a time to look for uh instant gratification but rather rewards that come from sincere and committed effort so in my case it's like there are new properties you know what i mean we don't have an overflow for it so i made my own i shared it with people that are, that are on my team i'm like hey you know, if you want this, it's here it is. Like, you know, I've been using that. So it's like the call flow is a lot better. I'm not struggling to find information because before it's like, you know, right at our, our fingertips, you know. 
I want to sit there and not um, be uh, put down during calls uh, due to Q&A. So it's like, okay, sit there and, you know, do what I've as asked me. Yeah, it takes a lot more effort to do. It's a lot more exhausting. But at the same time, it's like I don't have to sit there and go into that and be cursed at. Not cursed at. They never cursed at me. But it's just like, you know, where you feel... You know what I mean? You feel judged. They are judging you in, in a sense, but you know what I mean? Because they, you know, they expect everybody to perform at a certain level, but you know, it is what it is. They're saying take it with a grain of salt. It's kind of hard to. So the best way to get through a labor intensive project is to d identify son with uh, the work to become one with it. The place oneness of an, uh, of its uh, service. So grounding yourself, the sun, which is our ego, so with me, it's like, yeah, I can keep on doing, you know, the same thing over and over again. Definition of insanity. Or I can really take to heart what they're saying here and make that change. Sit there and, you know what I mean? It's just like, well, they're asking me th uh, this of me. Okay, let's, you know what I mean? I wrote it down. I have it on a piece of paper. I'm like, okay, you know, how can I sit there and, and uh, get this to work? So I'm doing it for the most part. It's just... Try to insert yourself when it, the, the call doesn't go the way that, you know, it's scripted, quote unquote. You know what I mean? It's like, this is the way the call should go. Sometimes it doesn't always go that way. So it's like, how do you flip into that script? So you're getting it done still. You know what I mean? So that's all. It's just retraining yourself. We have the magician. Education, training, knowledge, common sense, opportunities, translating through... Uh, translating thoughts and plans into action. So like with myself, okay, I need to work on this. Okay, let's work on this this week. Okay, we got this down. I feel comfortable with it. Let's get this down. So it's just getting comfortable with it, going with the flow with it. Sometimes I still forget it. You know, it's like, even though I've been doing it, it's like, oh, I forgot to ask for this because this one asked for a rewards program. I forgot to ask it. Dang it. You know? So it's just like trying to get that going. So... Beth means house. The magician allows us to begin building a ritual mental dwelling from which we can observe and learn from the world. Mercury is the planet of thinking and communi and communicating. So communicating with our higher self. Like when I was sitting there and they were saying like, you know, remember when you were at work and the relationship didn't work out, how awkward it was. And you know what I mean? It's just, you know, think of that higher self. You know what I mean? I feel like that's why that light is coming in. It's like, here's an opportunity, very much retrograde energy, to relive a moment again. You know, this is where you have definitely have to keep your own counsel. This is not where you sit there and share this with everybody. You know what I mean? I definitely feel like they're infatuated with you. I feel like they like you. But you know what I mean? Everybody is um, lured by mystery, you know, because they don't know you. You know what I mean? In the beginning, everything is all you know, great and everything. But as you go forward, it's not always going to be that way. You know what I mean? So they're saying like taking things out on you, like if it doesn't go well at work, it's not like they mean to, it's just they're venting and you're the person to vent to. So it's just be mindful of it. So intuitive insight, reconciling the opposites and intensive approach, withdrawal from everyday activities. And I feel like with the priestess, it's like, you know what I mean? Time for like meditation, doing what's, that's like, you know, like gardening, getting yourself out there. It's like, you know, your mind turns off and it's just like, you know, you're one with nature. So Gibby means camel. A camel is used to cross the desert regions. And the same way the priestess helps us cross the gulf between the conscious and, uh, and the subconscious. The moon is the planet of some of some conscious mind. Definitely been thriving in the moon energy. Last night we went out, no moon. I was like, meh. <laughs> no moon. It was freaking stunning the past two nights, though, before that. Um, what was it? I think it was Friday, Saturday. Oh, my God. Gorgeous. Stunning. I had my phone. I don't know why my phone was inside. I think I was recording or something. Yeah, I think I was recording and it was transferring onto the computer. And uh, I went outside to walk Sunny because it was getting late. I'm like, let me walk him and then come back in. The video should be done transferring over. And oh my god, it was so stunning. I sent some pictures to Zen. I'm like, look at it, it's so beautiful. You can hear the frogs outside. Oh, stunning. So the three of cups. Good times, celebrations, parties, good fortune, uh, forced cheer, 
expansive part uh, expansive partying overindulging don't we always overindulge during birthday parties but that's what I feel like. It's just like the, this eight of coins, this sun energy where it's like your ego. It's like, oh, I'm in a fight. You know, they were showing like, you know, we're pulling back on the reins really hard, you know, because we're so uh, determined to fight against this. Oh, we're going to fight against the man. Oh, I'm determined. You know, I demand this, you know, like, okay. We're all going through this transitional time. There's a lot of change going on. Yeah, we all don't like it. But the thing at the same time, why make it worse? Why make the situation worse for everybody? This is what's going on. They probably hate it as much as we do. Probably even more so. But the thing is, it's like, what, how do we honor our, our bosses that are not there right now? Is by showing what kind of sportsmen we are. What kind of workers we are. What kind of co-workers we are. This has happened. Okay, how can we work together to make this an easy transition? How do we, you know what I mean? Instead of making um, it worse, you know? So, I just... Think for yourself. Do not go with the flow with, you know, Neanderthals. Three cups. Mercury and Cancer. So funny enough, he's a Zodiac. No, he is Cancer. Setting the celebration allows you to communicate with others. Mercury. Your feelings of well-being and rudeness. Cancer. One of the hardest workers. You know, determination. They were showing the chariot, you know. Digging in our feet into a situation that doesn't require it. So going to the page of uh, coins. You know, we, we got that three of cups in the... Uh, the three of cups in the... Um, not the three of cups, excuse me. The uh, page of coins and the uh, eight of coins. You know, talking about like in three weeks time, this could be like something regarding work. In three weeks time, something's coming in here. You know, some of us have already gotten raises. I feel like because thing only came up. <laughs> but, um, so represents the beginning stages of material endeavor. You could be starting to uh, construct a, uh, phys uh, a physical object or beginning a project involving gardening, nurturing, diet, or exercise. So I definitely feel like a lot of us are outdoors more. And I feel like because it's so hot, nobody wants to cook. So, or you're eating more of the things like, you know, salads where it's more water-based than anything. You know what I mean? And it's just like, um, like they even say that, like, I remember on Global News, they say like, I, I remember they were like, this is this the lightest you'll be throughout the whole year because, you know, and I was just like, oh, no, I'm going to keep this off. But it's like you definitely see the shift and difference, you know what I mean? Where it's just like, you know, you're in this routine and I would only get like maybe four or five hours of sleep a night. But it didn't matter because it's like I would get up, I would go and, um, you know, start my day, do whatever. And then I had my routine, go, you know, clean up the litter box, go you know, take Odin outside or go out for coffee, you know what I mean? Get the things done on social media that I needed to get done. You know, kids, you know, whatever the day, you know, or if it was they were off of school, it's like, you know, they were in the pool or whatever, whatever the day brought, you know. You could be thinking about uh, becoming a parent. Oh, good gravy. Uh, taking the suit of coins more literally, you could be embarking on a new savings plan or investment. So pages are quote unquote learning. The page of coins is learning about material uh, reality. The the uh, approach suggests would be learn about the physical processes of going on around you. I feel like it's like for me, it's like news coming in. I understand what they're talking about investments, children. I've been having a lot of dreams about children. I'm like, oh my goodness, I don't think I can handle it. Like I love kids and everything, but it's just like I'm at the point of my life, especially my own. It's like, you know what I mean? It's like they're, you know, you know, Michael's in grade eight next year. Jenner's will be in grade 10. You know what I mean? So it's just like, you know what I mean? It's just a lot that way. And I feel like I'm already pulling myself in every direction as it is now. You know what I mean? And it's, a, it, you know, when they say talking about like, I feel like a new beginning, you know, when they talk about a child or a rebirth or something like that, I think it's like, Maybe you are thinking about like when they're talking about this knight of, of cups in the not as yourself, but as someone that has an interest. And they're like, be mindful, you know, where I worked with someone 
didn't realize that that was the situation because I was such an ass. You know, they're like, did you see? I'm like, no. I'm like, I really didn't. And they're just like, well, yeah, you you know what I mean? If I would have like, like, not just been so, you know, bedazzled or, you know, hit over the head, like, you know, with and infatuated with him, I probably would have seen more, you know? Take your time. You know what I mean? That's why they were saying, take your time because you'll see the whole picture. You know what I mean? But I feel like this is, again, another... I don't know if he's related to anyone, but it's just, I get that feeling. You know what I mean? So it's just like, mm, kind of watch where you're walking. Maybe it's not common knowledge, but that's why I feel like you're keeping your own console here. You know what I mean? And then like going into the hermit and it's just like meditating on the situation, grounding yourself in the situation. We are getting Virgo energy. You know what I mean? Especially with the pages where it's like ground yourself in the situation, you know, take away the fact that it's like, you know, learning and everything like that. In this situation where you're working with someone and there's a love. Yeah, sometimes it does work out. You know what I mean? But sometimes it doesn't work out. And I feel like that's where it's not trying to be negative. It's just like, you know, I don't think this is something that's going to really, you know, last here. You know, with judgment, a rebirth in our life. You know what I mean? Rebirth could be any transformative way. You know, I definitely get elevation, higher self. Lots of triangles have been really uh, highlighted lately. But... I feel like it's just uh, be mindful and see where you're going with this. And it's just, you know, like at the end of the day, it's like you don't want to lose your job over something so stupid. You know what I mean? I don't feel like you'll lose your job. I just feel like it'll be more uncomfortable. You know what I mean? So be very mindful of that. You know what I mean? You know, so especially that's why I feel like they're saying office politics. That's why I feel I don't know. I don't know for a fact if they are related to someone, but I feel like they are. So and I don't feel like it's common knowledge. So be very wary of it. So I hope you guys enjoyed these daily tarot cards for Wednesday, May 10th, 2023. May the universe bless you good. We'll see you for the next daily tarot card. Bye.